The design for the original vehicle was started in 1947 by Morris Wilkes. It was simply called Land Rover, the term Series and Defender are retroactive and only introduced in the 1990s. Wilkes, chief designer at the Rover Company, on his farm in Newborough, Anglesey, working in conjunction with his brother Spencer who was the managing director of Rover. 10. The design may have been influenced by the Jeep 11, and the prototype, later nicknamed Center Steer, was built on a Jeep chassis and axles. 12. The early choice of color was dictated by military surplus supplies of aircraft cockpit paint, so early vehicles only came in various shades of light green, all models until recently feature sturdy box section ladder frame chassis. Early vehicles like the Series I were field tested at Long Bennington and designed to be field serviced. Land Rover as a company has existed since 1978. Prior to this, it was a product line of the Rover company which was subsequently absorbed into the Rover Triumph division of the British Leyland Motor Corporation BL, following Leyland Motor Corporation's takeover of Rover in 1967. The ongoing commercial success of the original Land Rover series models, and latterly the Range Rover in the 1970s in the midst of BL's well-documented business troubles prompted the establishment of a separate Land Rover company but still under the BL umbrella, remaining part of the subsequent Rover Group in 1988, under the ownership of British Aerospace after the remains of British.